Hey, I'm Donnie, a guitar player for Faithhead. Um, we were asked to just do a short video, and uh, so I'm going to give you a quick uh, gear rundown on what I'm currently using. It changes uh, week to week. I'm a kind of a gear snob, I guess a lot of people call it, so I'm always changing it up a little bit. But this week, we have um, starting with amplification. Um, Mesa Boogie um, early 2000s model which is the best sounding re triple rectifier that you can get in my opinion um, running into a Hughes and Kettner um, 412 with uh, Celestium Vintage 30s um, playing through a uh, John Pachusi signature model Stealth Black um, Guitar um, my backup is a Jackson Kelly made in Japan. Um, I'm in love with it as well. And I'm in love with it right now more as just a backup guitar. Um, now this, uh, this mess down here is uh, basically how I do my channel switching. Um, it's also how I get my crazy um, organ sounds that I use in Burn. Um, so basically we're running into a channel selector which I only use for uh, to go to my tuner um, so then line B goes into a uh, wall volume just saves pedal board space because this thing I don't know if you can tell in the video is it's it's a massive board um, so then I go out into a um, philosopher's tone um, it's a optical compressor I use it for a lot of clean tones it adds a lot of sustain that into a Rook Royale, which 99% of the time I only use the um, boost side, which is a Echoplex based uh, preamp. Um, I use this in a couple of songs just to boost the gain and kind of um, give it a little more mid-range growl. Um, I use this at church. I don't use this for Faith Head. This guy right here, you will hear it in one of our upcoming recordings. Um, it's Rise Up. This is a Black Arts Toneworks uh, Fnord. Um, this is a custom one-off print. Um, thank you very much, Mark Wentz, for that. Um, but this is about the nastiest sounding fuzz you're going to hear in your entire life. That runs then into my, uh, my delay which I do not run through an effects loop. Strymon Timeline, love it. It'll do anything you could possibly ever want. I run into a zoom, and I mainly use this as a EQ and some reverb for some clean tones. Into a Mimic Doubler, which uh, really thickens the sound up. If you're running into one amplifier, it almost adds a chorusy effect to it. If you're running into dual amps, it just it's it's a great dual amp pedal. Um, it truly captures the sound of a double tracked guitar. Um, and then here I've got my channel switcher, um, and that's basically it. Um, I'll give you 30 seconds worth of sounds that I get, and then we'll call it a night. This is a clean tone that you hear in Burn that you think is a keyboard, but it's really not. This is my main drive sound. And this is my drive with the Mimic Doubler. And I mean that's that's a basically that, that's pretty much all we're using um, right now. Um, if you want a little taste of the fuzz that you're going to hear in our new song, Rise Up. There's a taste of that. Thanks so much for tuning in. Hope you guys have a great evening.